Well, this is Coin 6 News at 11. I'm Wayne Haverly. As the vaccine rollout continues in Oregon, advocates for harder hit communities say community health centers could be a key to making sure all those doses get to the right people once they're available. Coin 6's Jennifer Dowling is going beyond the headlines tonight with a look at the pressing needs of the Hispanic community in our area. Jennifer. Good evening, Wayne. Well, we spoke to those health leaders and they say some of the biggest barriers to the Hispanic community are misinformation, mistrust and lack of access to those larger vaccination clinics and some local health leaders want to change that. We think it's really important that health centers like Virginia Garcia are really prioritized in, in the outreach efforts to these populations to address the um, the health equity goals of the state and uh, some of the disparities that, that we're seeing. Leaders at Virginia Garcia Memorial Health say they'll be using their community connections to help increase COVID-19 vaccine distribution in the Hispanic community. Through social media and various other means, there's uh, often miscommunication or misinformation about the virus. Um, we want to um, make sure that people understand that the vaccines are safe. Gil Munoz says oftentimes folks in this population are concerned about providing too much information to medical facilities or hospitals for a variety of reasons, including concerns over immigration status or that of a family member. This is a concern that we have, you know, with uh, how accessible uh, um, large uh, mainstream events are going to be for populations that are already a bit leery of accessing and providing information to authorities. Gill says unlike large vaccination clinics, health centers like Virginia Garcia have been in the community for over 45 years and have the trust and practice of reaching out to the population. At uh, farm worker camps, at nurseries, vineyards, you know, um, in school parking lots and church parking lots throughout our service area. Gill hopes the state will soon prioritize essential workers for the vaccine, a group that also includes a large Hispanic population. With Oregon Health Authority and, and local health departments, and we hope to see that essential workers are prioritized in the next round of uh, vaccine distribution. Again, because they are so disproportionately impacted by the virus. And Gil says, as for the healthcare workers at the facility, some of them are going to get their rounds of vaccines this coming week as another allocation comes in in relation to vaccine distribution. So those healthcare workers are getting their vaccines, and next step will be those community members. Back to you, Wayne.